The quick match on a property is designed, as the name suggests, as a quick way of matching. You do not get taken to the match grid. You do not get the option to send via any other output method other than an email, and you do not get to work with your matches beforehand. But on the property record, open up the action menu. Under the matching option, you've got your quick match. It instantly comes back and tells you how many matches it's found. You press the OK button and you are presented with the email. So there is no chance to do a sense check and remove any of the unwanted matches or to remove anybody that you know does not want to receive emails from you. Once again, we are matching a single property to multiple applicants. So we can use the sort of generic subject here. Mark our matches as complete and exclude upon completion. And that will mean then that any matches that it doesn't send will be left in the match grid, which we aren't in front of. So we're going to go and have to find later on anyway. So press the save button. It found us 12 matches and it sent out 11 emails. So there is one person that did got that got matched to this property, but did not get the match email. So to process completely your matches, right click, matching, match processor, and you're presented with the person that did not want to receive emails from you. At this point, you could send via another output method, text messages or letters and lists, or you can untick this person right click and reject excluded. Make sure your match grid is empty, close it down and on the events tab of the property record you will see that those quick matches have are now sitting on the events tab. They will also be sitting on the events tab of the individual applicants as well. So the match processor is a formal way of matching. The match the quick match is a very simple way of matching, but you do not get to work with your matches beforehand.